Hi guys, Chubby here again. I'm gonna open up Forbidden Siren 2 and uh, you know, hopefully it's a good game. Uh, I just completed Forbidden Siren 1 which you saw in my other video. So I thought I'd open this bad boy up and uh, see if it's any good. I don't know if you can tell but I'm extremely excited. I, I hope they have the archive items in this one still. Fingers crossed. Okay, let's see. Whoa, this is a big booklet. Wow. The graphics are very good. Look at it. Wow. Survival tips. Wow. This booklet is awesome. You can drive as well. Wow. Awesome. Oh, the Shibito, the Abito. Oh, they've got new enemies. Awesome. Huh. Nice. Look, there's a Shibito I told you about, Shibito. The Shibito, the dead. The Shibito were once human, now their souls are possessed by a mysterious force. Although the Shibito retains their control over their physical bodies, they lack intelligence and can thus be easily diverted by simple tricks. When a Shibito takes so much damage, that it perishes, it simply finds a new host and rises once again, somewhat adapted to an above round resistance on Yamajima, the Shibito possess a tolerance to light. Originally human, the Yambito, people of the dark, uh, have mutated into a species that is completely at odds with modern science. Unlike the Shibito, the Yambito exhibit extreme intelligence and when defeated are able to self-regenerate. Their habitual hatred of light has for some reason recently been replaced by a certain level of tolerance. So what's making them stronger, huh? Uh, look at that for being assigned to. Here's the disc. There we go. You don't have anyone on the front cover of this disc, I'm surprised. Let me see. Look, freshly brand new. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh, awesome. I'm going to review it when I played it. Oh wow, how cool is that? It doesn't come with an art book or it doesn't come with any postcards or anything, but I'm okay with that. Hopefully it's going to be a great game. From the island of darkness, a siren calls. A group of strangers are approaching the mysterious Japanese island of Yamajima when a blood-red tsunami pitches their boat into the waves. Those that survived the storm may soon wish they hadn't. 29 years ago, the inhabitants of Yamajima vanished during a blackout, leaving the island of darkness guarded by guarded by creatures from the netherworld. Each survivor is unwittingly entwined in the island's gruesome past and must now defend themselves with any weapon they can find. To stay alive, they must also learn to slide jack, a unique ability to see through the eyes of others, including the enemy, thus foreseeing the unspeakable horrors that lie in store for them. Fifteen contains strong violence. Do you like that? <laughs> Do you like that voice I did? <laughs> oh god. Alright then. I'm just so excited to play this. See you later guys.